Uh, what's up folks, uh, welcome back, I'm Daily Fix. Uh, well, um, this is all from the same somewhat stream. I, I really was frustrated after last mission and I had a bit of a cooling down period. <laughs> I need those, don't judge me. And um, here we are again, playing X4. We, um, we're going to be doing the Protectorate mission. Uh, the Pirate's Trail. Um, still have to look into that data vault that we didn't do. Um, I, I'm, I'm streaming again. I was very, very pissed off. So, yeah. Actually, I should flip my camera here. I was really angry at, at the, the final bit. Uh, because, you know, I was just... Uh, things were not going my way. And people really felt I was funny. And it pissed me off. It really pissed me off. So here we are. We um, you will find that our planet Terra Nova is uh, is now much more livable. So here we go. And our planet Terra Nova in the Cigara system is now a much more livable place once again. Again, great thanks to you for the part you played in this. Farewell, friend. Okay. Now we currently we currently have a relation of 20 which allows us access to earth and the moon so we can probably get yeah i know i know uh, but i got pissed at the actually uh which i should not have done but i was really angry um we are going to let one of our ships explore these systems probably drop satellites because we need our money uh, so you, do you have, let's get some satellites in here, a bunch of them, I don't know if we need all of them, let's add to shopping cart, confirm order, and uh, once he is done, I want you to go fly away over there, and we'll explore these systems and place down satellites because I'm not going to be spending 10 million on the trade license at the moment. Now, we have the promotion to hero. We are going to set that to active. And are we going to be taking our own Hello seat there. again from this, um, from this pilot? And let's head on over to... Accelerator. The Asteroid accelerator. Belt. Actually, it will bring us um, a bit further away than I was kind of hoping because it will bring us to the faction representative. And we're not going there. Uh, we're actually going Terra to be our ship. And we're going to be getting ourselves a new ship. And this time it's going to be a medium. Docking granted. And it's Please the one with the six engines. Them. And uh, eventually we'll have our own place where we'll store all of our ships. Um, but for now, it's an honor to have you aboard. It is. Now we can choose between the uh, the katana, the john, and the flex. Now I'm working tomorrow, mate. Sorry, can't do it. And I'm most likely going to for this one. Um, the one. Th th this is not very ideal. Yes, it has a lot of turrets. Uh, folks where by the katana. Yeah, I don't know. You know... Let's take a look. 7 million. We have... Um, a burst weapon output of... Almost 18. How about this one? Oh, actually... Interesting. The other ship has more hull than this ship. Hmm. I did use this one, and I like the two upper ones because uh, they usually overshoot you. Yeah, look at that. We got 10,000 more hull. Uh, 10,000 less shields. 
Uh, the default uh, two million. Yeah, and, uh, I I don't I don't like um, it's these mason lasers. I hate them. I really don't like these. Um, I'm probably going for the positional barrage. Um, yeah, the masons are horrible. They, they, they're fixed. And it sucks. It really sucks. Gatling? Um, it's this one, right? The Positon Barrage. I think those are the, uh... Yeah, true. It just goes to 6,000. Um, also, it was the trade order. Um... Let's see if I can pronounce you non-sequent er uh, Dave. Non-sequent your Dave. Uh, we're actually we, w we were talking in the first part of the stream about the trade orders. But um The Bolt Reaper yeah. I like this one a lot. The burst were not so much, um, but these weapons are pretty cool. And this is the high preset, right? Apart from uh, the stuff of the Commonwealth engine thing, it flies fast. So here's the shields. The turrets. Um, we need to change those to... Actually, could we leave the turrets on? Should we leave the turrets on the same area? Or should we make it the dual pulse turrets? I'm um, not too sure. No, it's true. Terrans is definitely... But I feel the Terrans are lacking in a lot of departments, actually. Here's some flares. Uh, we could use some friend of old mines. And yeah, this is pretty good. Yeah, the shields are really strong. And I'm going to put you on defend. Because they, they can be nice if they can actually target. If the turrets can just target the enemy and just follow them, that's good. But I can't do that. You probably, the turrets are way better than me. Yeah. There you go. I've said it. Let us order one ship. Confirm that order. And now that the subordinates are working again for the factory the one thing that I don't like is we are currently selling to the Terrans as well we could have said that but that would probably stop them but they are currently doing their job so I'm back as combi choosers uh, we're slowly getting more money and this guy needs to level up so forward guns are Gibral um, Gin Belt I don't know. It's um, it's it's a weird word f for sure. How are you doing? This might also help with this. Let's see if we can actually get the advanced. No, still not getting them. Oh well. Yeah, it, it just they're just fixed. They're fixed in the center position. Let's just call it fixed, it's easier. Uh, and and it, it's horrible. I've seen uh, Wenek actually use them, um, but I cannot. So we're currently waiting for the new ship, which is going to be done in 40 seconds. Let's go to the... Um, yeah, not no, there's a tiny bit of a fraction. True. Uh, let's get up. And let's get waiting for the new ship. Uh, we will need it. So, 21 seconds. Should we give more subordinates to this guy so we can level up a bit more? Like, he's level 2. We can give him a few more. Maybe two more couriers. Yeah, that, yeah, that, that's true. Uh, it's, it's just, I don't like them, at least. But... Here we go. You are going to be doing the auto 
sector explore puts you down to about 400 and you can go up to 90. Center, confirm that. Go. Security would like okay, to now remind all visitors the new to ship take their done. belongings with them at all times. So let's go to the katana. And katana. you're in my seat, get out. Hello there. The split ships are bloody amazing. They got like five or six weapons or so. Six forward weapons, yeah, that's strong. I believe it's like from the... Um... Yeah, it is the split. Yeah, it's the one that you will get eventually. You can actually buy that one. It's a medium ship. It's a great ship. It really is a good ship. Um, didn't actually want to undock here. Docking granted. So let's get back in here. Um, can I... I need, um... Advanced satellites for this mission. Okay, yeah, we need to dock. Now, while we do this... There you go. Uh, while we do this, uh, we're going to be getting ourselves... I think we need... Four or five advanced done. satellites. Before I forget, otherwise we'll have to take that somewhere else. It's an honor to have you aboard. Yeah, very much so. Confirm that. Confirm order. Let's get up. I love my logo in there. And... Never mind, this is not where I want to go. That's what I love about this ship. You can just walk out. They could hold fast weapons. The problem number shields. Yeah. The, it's the yak. Yeah, the yakis. That's the one. It's the yakis. Um, you will get it, I believe, eventually, once you get that, um, that cloaking ship. Right? So let's go to the secret service. Hello there. And let's get this mission done. Uh, before we do, let's order two more couriers. Minimum preset. Well, who no low preset like they got the basics right and get some service crew in there and let's get let's get three so we get five small couriers on our solar power plant he's already looking for new trade but he is currently being uh, harassed by the police So, Project Genesis. Operative, we were under the impression that you went AWOL and launched an investigation into your disappearance. I will update your personal dossier before you run into trouble. Let's take your statement. I am hereby informing you that you are being recorded. Operative, you may begin. The Sagaris pioneers are capable of moving stations. Third party involvement. I see. We will investigate this boron. Is Good there idea. anything else to report? New intel on Project Genesis? No. You stand we, relieved. We, we can terraform. It's like a huge deal. Uh, COVID operation. Through your work on the Xenon front, you have proven yourself to be a valuable asset to the Terran cause. We might have another task for you. This one will require a somewhat softer touch, though. Having someone in our corner who is familiar with diplomacy and backroom deals will be critical to this operation's success. Our agents have been watching an analyst <laughs> going by the name of I, I, Dal Busta. Yeah, he is currently does. negotiating on behalf of the Hatikva Free League. Get in contact with this Busta character and get acquainted with the political situation outside the Sol system. There we go. Um, actually, this is the uh, the Hatva League. 
Um, let us look into the outpost incident. Ever since you handed in your report, my people have been working tirelessly to find a connection between a number of intriguing events that have occurred in Seoul <laughs> yes, he does over have the a course bitty, of the last few weeks. Pretty weird way of pronouncing The first that. incidents were barely out of the ordinary. High-tech traders missing cargo, manipulated delivery schedules, the occasional kidnapping and ransoming. Then things began to ramp up. Top secret deliveries being raided, fake distress signals targeting our military trainees, sabotage on a grand scale, and lately, more and more of these incidents involve the Xenon in some fashion. We can no longer ignore the possibility of a major new threat to the Terran Protectorate. That is true, but, uh, but still, I'm, I'm not pretty sure I want to do a lot of satellites, mate. Based on recent evidence, my people are fairly sure that our opponents are the infamous Yaki. In a nutshell, they're, They're pirates. Our data suggested that they originated as members of the Argon Federation, another splinter group they couldn't keep under control. The Yaki have always dabbled in dangerous technology, and they seem to have only doubled down on that alarming compulsion since we last had the pleasure of making contact. One of their criminal spin-off enterprises, the infamous Beryl, was responsible for an AGI drone attack on Earth in recent history. Expect their ships to be heavily armed and highly maneuverable. But isn't it slowing down your game? Just have so many satellites. Ah, yes, indeed. I recognize you might have personal reasons for your interest. So it seems only prudent to offer you this assignment first. The objective is simple. Find out where these pirates are hiding, what their goals are, and whether they can be defeated. Unfortunately, you will only be able to call upon limited support during your mission. As an undercover operative, it is paramount that no direct connection can be drawn between you and the Terran Secret Service. Once you leave Protectorate Space, you're on your own. I can provide some guidance to help you get started, but ultimately, you will be the one making decisions under pressure. You and Cadet Shinneman recently encountered an especially malicious distress signal trap that was presumably set by these Yaki. They seem to be targeting specific Terran ships for some reason. And since they're keen on eliminating anyone who follows their trail, that reason remains a mystery to us. If we catch them in the act, that will tell us more about their objectives. An advanced satellite should be able to pick up on all distress signals in the sector. My team will evaluate the data and point you towards potential discrepancies. With your record, you will do just fine, Operative. I'll leave you to prepare. Well, luckily we did the preparation before. And yeah, actually, you, you tried... Uh, I'll just call you Dave. Um, you're right, man. Uh, the, the, the ships are still there, they just don't show up. So might as well go for satellites. Uh, looks like... Are you doing anything right now? You are. So that is slowly going. Let's take a look at these frogs. Uh, we're just adding them here. I know there's not a lot of trade right now because I know that, uh, well, the Terrans do love their trade. And I think, let's take a look if I'm sure. Yeah, there you go. No capacity. Everything is gone. They, uh, they stripped the station clean. Uh, so, yeah, that is something, huh? But in terms of finances, let's close this. Let's go here. It is this, this 300k. So, it's fine. It is fine. Uh, once we actually get the hacking bit done on production, we'll, uh, we'll definitely start doing more. I don't want to spend my money like crazy. And we're just here to level up our uh, manager. So let's um, get back to the Katana. Since that is the, uh, the slow ship that we're going to be flying for this mission. Hello there. 
Yeah, it is cheap as heck. Are you using the regular satellites or the advanced satellites then? Let's undock. Autopilot. And let's do autopilot. Engaged. Let's see if this ship is uh, less annoyed by the AI. Okay, well that doesn't do anything then. Autopilot. Engaged. Yeah, that's just 5k, that... oof. That's just 5k, that's nothing. That is nothing. While we do the autopiloting, let's go... Take a look. So, we're going over there. Now, I know we need to go, I believe, to Uranus. And then eventually we'll go into Triumph. So, fun times. Fun times, actually. Uh, we need to save up our money can't wait to actually place down satellites down here there's another support station they usually do tend to buy quite a bit um i don't have a mariah ready for myself I just and yeah, currently i'm unable to trade with any of the other factions so that's going to be difficult accelerator asteroid belt so once we're there, we we'll drop a satellite. Let's uh Oh yeah, these ship, these weapons will do fine. These weapons do absolutely fine. Well, we don't have minus yet. But one we once we do oh man, we just the speed has been cut in half. That's a bit uh unfortunate. Um, I haven't tried it yet. I don't want to do that with this this very, well, very tiny ship. Oh, okay. Good to know. Okay, all of that's going. Actually, trade not doing too badly. One of my dogs is just... I think he hears something. Are we getting trade now? Still the advanced electronics is a huge problem. But I'm, I'm, I'm kind of okay with them not liking me for the main story. Eventually... Entering we're going to take over belt. the galaxy. Anywhere within this sector will be fine, operative. Okay, so let's drop down. Let's see here. Two medical emergencies and a harmless collision at the docking queue. Nothing out of the ordinary. Patrols are already moving in to assist. Carry on with your task. Yeah, it is actually accelerator. It's not that bad. Jupiter. Um the story by itself is it's quite nice. And you'll get a, a, some half-baked chips, which is true. Every time? Oh, dude, no. Don't do that every time. How many hours do you got in next four? Dude? Can't wait until he's level three. Once they're level three, we will be pulling these guys out of the asteroid belt as well. And eventually they will run uh, energy cells. So we might need to upgrade this. Oh. Uh, I wish that I've played. Uh, I've play I should have played the others first. I had this Master Collection box. You know, this was before Steam. And... Um, it is, um, it was very difficult to get into. What is he doing? Okay, Auto never pilot. mind. Auto pilot. Never mind. I'll Disengage. offer myself because this guy is just making me. <laughs> no, 
but luckily the arrogance don't have that issue, right? Entering Jupiter. Beautiful, isn't it? Solid piece, I mean. I hope we can keep it that way. The range of these advanced satellites is crazy, though. And here we are. You just have to know what to watch out for. A civilian transport locked an unidentified vessel, creeping about at the edges of the sector, refusing to answer when being asked for directions. There's no mention of a patrol encounter, so that ship might still be out there. Judging by the log trajectory, we may be able to make a strike in the next sector. Well, That's we, a lead. we humans do have the tendency to um, stick our noses of things that don't belong in that area. Accelerator. Interesting. We're getting dangerously close to Segaris Pioneer's territory. They're spread thin and rely on Terran trade. That makes them especially vulnerable to these pirate raids. If I were a shadowy nemesis that wanted to strike the Protectorate where it's weakest, Pioneer's space is where I'd begin. Now I hear it too, the pro Protectorate. Damn it. <laughs> yeah, okay. Okay, let's get over to the uh, position there. Let's take a look how things are going. Um, how long would it take to level this guy up? Five subordinates. And we're gaining quite a good amount of energy cells per. Requesting permission to dock. Docking permission granted. Oh, man, I missed the speed of the previous ship so badly. Look how slow things go. It cost them a lot of money too, but I uh, wasn't aiming to kill the Terrans. Just to keep them out of arrogant affairs because the Terrans were in... Uh, well, I, I believe they still want to. Um, that's why we are going to be conquering the galaxy. We could potentially... I kind of don't want to buy any blueprints though. I want to use the money for my own ships and the hacking will use to get blueprints. Yeah, that is true, man. That is true. So I had to talk to my dog that he should should lie down. It's it's like 3 a.m. in the morning for me. Okay. There we go. Entering Saturn. We're right into the ring. I've relaxed. I was very pissed at you, mate. No hits. That's somewhat unexpected. No, there's something here. A faint signal my team can't quite pinpoint. Ooh. I believe a more in depth search is in order. I think we... Yeah, there we go. In-depth search, huh? Ah, oh, there we go. That produced a result, at least. If you keep this up, you'll be able to narrow down the signal's origin. Move towards the new search area and try again. Oh, yes. If, if at first you don't succeed, try, try, try again. Getting clearer. That is, that is, that is, wow. Damn. That, 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 that. I'm impressed. <laughs> the pyramid, yeah, I like, but I like the building types of the pyramids as well. They look good. Come on, now. Huh? Yeah. 
Yeah, they do like that combat, don't they? Great. Keep it up. Will do. Um, after the first wave, I'm, I'm ending the recording. Terran katana with Terran shields with Terran weapons, but arrogant engines. I like what you. I, I like your thinking. Empty space. No, it's not empty space. Come on, keep going. We've almost got it. That's my meme sector frigate. Oh, it's still, it, it, it sounds good. It sounds really good. Unknown zone. Okay, so we should be very near now. So let's uh, slow down. Come on. Okay, we'll probably have to scan into a different direction. There we go. I'll assign a local patrol to assist you right away. These pirates won't ambush us this time. Are these guys? Could be. Hmm. Huh. That would be that would be something. Unknown ship. I uh, will wait here. We'll um we are going to be assisting or we're going to get assistance. Here they are. And uh, once they're here, we'll get the location on where we need to go. Anyways, this is a very good dropping off point. Guys, not a lot has happened. I'm just glad that my station is now finally selling. We're slowly getting money. We might eventually upgrade it a tiny bit more. But not too much, because energy doesn't make you so much and anyway. So, uh. Uh, next episode, we'll continue the mission, we'll have some combat, and we'll probably get into a new ship, if possible. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.